my channel welcome if you're new here it's really really lovely to have you today i've got a h&m haul for you i've got some cozy bits i've got some party outfits so definitely a real variety of things when you see this video it'll be going out just before cyber week starts so I imagine that H&M will have some amazing discounts already started or starting very soon. One thing that's slightly frustrating is that H&M don't do next day delivery, which is obviously such a first world problem. But it means by the time I've got things that I film, that I put the video up, that a lot of things are out of stock. Which I know can be super annoying when you're watching the video, you want to purchase the things I'm talking about. But hopefully some of these are still in stock. And if not, then hopefully there's some kind of inspiration from these things and they'll have something similar on the website because they tend to bring similar pieces out. Another, another thing that I just wanted to quickly mention, if you've watched my previous couple of videos, I spoke in quite a lot of detail about my business, Truly Neutral Collection, which is going to be launching tomorrow when you see this video. So Monday the 22nd of November. Just a bit of a notice to say, if you did want to get anything, make sure that you're poised and ready to purchase. We're launching at 6pm um, over on the Truly Neutral Collection website. I'll leave all the details in the description below, including my Instagram and the Truly Neutral Collection Instagram, so you can keep really up to date over on there. But also, I know that there's a lot of things that I'm telling you at the beginning of this video, but I'm also going to be keeping a close eye on all the Black Friday sales and my top picks from those sales. I'll be housing most of that over on my my blog which is chloeburnley.com or also over on my Instagram which is chloe.burnley if the Black Friday sales is something that interests you and you want to get yourself a really good deal because I know that some of them have already started we're seeing 30 40 50 percent off at so many retailers so it's a hundred percent worth snapping some new stuff up if you want some new things for your new wardrobe perfect for gift ideas i've also got my gift guides which i'll leave in the description below i reckon that a lot of those items on those gift guides will have some sort of reduction on them so it's a really great time to purchase gifts as well or even beauty products like beauty product sales self tan makeup hair care is hugely discounted across the Black Friday sale. So now let's get in to the actual haul and show you the bits that I picked up. So I'm gonna start with this cream jumper. If you are eagle-eyed, you can probably tell that it's the exact same jumper that I'm wearing at the minute, but just in cream. This actually on the website was called like grey beige. I think it was greyish, but I would definitely say it's more on the cream side. I now have this jumper in three different colours. This cream colour, a grey and also a taupe colour that they brought out originally. I love it. I have literally been living in them recently. They're so comfy. They're a really lovely like high neck style and also they have this split hem at the side which I just find is like a really comfortable style to wear. It's so easy to slip on with some leather leggings. Just throw it on and you're put together and good to go. So I'm loving these jumpers. This, I know, isn't currently available. If you go over to the H&M website and pop your email in, the stock notifications, things usually come back in stock in different sizes. I know that happened with the grey and the taupe one, so hopefully it'll happen with the cream one as well, and you might be able to get your hands on it. But yeah, this one's actually probably my favourite colour out of the three of them, but I do equally love them all. So if they're still on the website, I'll leave them all in the description. So hopefully you can go and register your interest and then stock up on them. But so sticking with the knitwear, I got this jumper dress and this is like an oatmeal jumper dress with a roll neck collar which is super beautiful and I'm definitely into a roll neck at the minute but the jumper dresses I want to love. I really want a really nice easy to wear jumper dress that can pop on with tights or even without tights and some knee high boots but they just don't seem to suit my figure i think i just look really like frumpy in them and oversized but i see so many people looking so amazing in them now i think the only way i could possibly pull this off is by putting some sort of belt or elasticated waistband through the middle and then kind of like tucking it under like that just to add a little bit more shape these honestly just like drown my body and for someone that's more of a mid-sized body that just really is not a flattering look see i'm probably still on the hunt for the perfect jumper dress for me but this one is a beauty i love the color i love the roll neck it's a really good length as well because some of them are super short but still a very beautiful jumper dress 
and I'm pretty sure it's like $24.99 or something so for the quality and everything for a really good staple piece in your wardrobe it's a really good buy. So we may as well stick with knitwear and this is also another roll neck but this is very fine knit roll neck so I thought that these would be perfect for like the staple jumper you know if you're wearing like a nice skirt or if you like kind of that like pinafore dungaree pinafore kind of look and you want to layer something under or just under a dress like a sleeveless dress would look really nice just kind of layered underneath that perfect to be tucked into a skirt if you like that kind of look laid under a blazer for example worn with leather leggings i just thought that this would be a great staple jumper which can just be worn as kind of a filler piece you know when you have something really nice and you don't know what to pair it with i think that this is kind of one of those great pairing pieces so this one was 12.99 which i thought was a really good price again kind of fits into the basic essential price range this one is like the ivory cream color but it also came in a few other colors i believe there might have been like a black and maybe like a burgundy berry color so there's a few options to choose from love this one and the perfect basic essential now this dress for me is like the perfect christmas festive season dress such a beauty i do actually have this as well in like the champagne gold color which i featured in one of my recent h&m hauls i believe but i actually wore to a wedding and it was so so perfect for the occasion this is the exact same dress in black it's a satin kind of sheen look it almost looks very you know chic and expensive but is actually like a 25 pound dress which kind of blows my mind I love the cut of this dress. It's got a really beautiful high neck detail. The cuffs are really big, which you probably know if you've been on this channel for a while, how much I love a thick, deep cuff. I think that they add such a statement and elegance to an outfit. And then it kind of just like flows down a little bit. Now I don't go too oversized in this. I got this in a medium and I would say that in most standard places I'm more like a large to an extra large so it's definitely roomy and a little bit more floaty which is perfect for my type of body but I got the medium so it's slightly more fitted so even though it does kind of float over it's not really massive and it's not like a smock dress on me it's more of that kind of fitted style of dress. I absolutely love this dress and I know that with like a really lovely pair of heels, you could even go sparkly heels, a sparkly little clutch or really nice little crossbody bag, it's just going to look perfect for basically any occasion over the festive period, a Christmas party, a work Christmas party, a night out with your friends, a dinner, anything like that. You could even pair this with some knee high boots if you wanted to go a little bit more casual rather than a full heel, but you could also dress it up to like the nines and go all out and glam. And even though there's no like kind of embellishment, it doesn't look hugely special. It's actually such an amazing dress because as I say, it can be paired up with so many different things to elevate it it can be dressed down but i also think it just looks incredibly like expensive the cut of it because it is so minimal as soon as i saw they brought this out in black as well i was like that is going straight in my basket because i love that and i love my gold one so much too so another party style dress and i haven't tried this one yet so i'm not sure if it fits me um, but I still love it nonetheless, even if it's not suitable for me. But it's this blazer style, kind of party-esque dress. I really love this as well. This was a super affordable party dress too, around the £30 mark, I believe. I think this did come in black as well. I'm not sure if these are still available, but hopefully they are. It's got a little bit of weight to it as well, which I think is really reflective of a good quality dress. And the structure of it feels just really nice. The material feels gorgeous. I love this colour. I think I prefer this one to the black. Even though I think black is kind of better for longevity because I think that that is so, so timeless. And the ways that you can style that up are definitely timeless. But I still think this champagne gold colour is pretty timeless too and it's definitely a colour that I am drawn to that I love. I think it's really complimentary. Um, when you've got a lovely bit of self tan on and you've done your hair and you look really glamorous 
This one fits, which I'm hoping it will. This will definitely become a staple party dress for me as well. Great for nights out. But again, you could pair this with some really nice heeled knee-high boots and just keep it that little bit more informal. Perfect if you were going out for dinner or something and you didn't want to wear like the full strappy heel look. So then the final clothing item I have to show you, I've also got a pair of shoes in a minute. But the final clothing item is this beautiful puffer coat and it is like a bit of a fluffy marshmallow. I literally felt like a fluffy marshmallow wearing this. But I literally adore this coat. I think it's such a beautiful coat. So practical, even though some of you might be like, practical is white. Like <laughs> That is the least practical colour. But I'll get on to that in a minute. But I think it is super practical, really warm, easy to wear but still stylish coat because don't get me started on coats that just make me feel frumpy and ugly and i would only wear them for like the dog walking or like you know the coats that you definitely don't save for best this is probably going to become my don't save the best coat. The reason I actually bought this was to go to a bonfire party that my friends were having. They were having like a party and I knew that there'd be smoke and all sorts going on. So I didn't really want to wear one of my more tailored coats that I knew would be impossible to get the smoke scent out of that coat. And also just because they're, they're nicer and smarter coats, I don't want to wear them to an event like that. Not like this one, which is an absolute dream to be honest. This also comes in black, but I was completely drawn to the white. And as I said earlier, you might be thinking, Chloe, you are actually bonkers to think that a white coat is practical. But I did wear this to a bonfire and it basically has no remnants of ever being anywhere near smoke it's got the tiniest bit of makeup just on the collar because obviously it was touching my like neck and chin area but realistically for the amount of like tan and makeup and things that i have on i would have thought that this white coat would have been covered like even if it was just marks on it whatever it whatever it may be it really isn't and as long as you're relatively careful and don't spill like a whole hot chocolate or coffee down yourself then i think it's absolutely fine it's got a really nice hood as well absolutely love this coat and we'll get so much wear out of it plus it was 35 pounds which was an actual steal because i've been looking at a few longer line puffer duvet type coats for when we go to paris because we are going to disney and i know that it'll be chilly in december and that i want to keep nice and snug and warm but also look really nice for pictures and things like that but i think that this one will probably suffice for disney and i think for 35 pounds it's just like why do i want to spend more money on a different coat when this one is just so amazing so h&m is a great place to check out the coats the quality is amazing and the price point is fantastic if you're just wanting a little bit more of a run around coat and i actually don't think this classes as that i think this is a really beautiful lovely coat if you couldn't tell by my whole previous spiel on how much i love this coat and then the final thing i have to show you which is kind of like to go with the puffer jacket and the puffer look are these boots now i had been eyeing these up on the website for quite some time and finally took the plunge to get them they for me are so prada-esque for a very very affordable price tag for a pair of really sturdy good quality boots i believe these were 35 pounds something around that price point most things were to be fair 25 35 pounds they have a really sturdy black it won't be real leather i wouldn't have thought but leather you know faux leather sturdy boots they have these lace-up detailing at the front and then around the ankle is this kind of like cozy snuggled ankle warmer which i love i love this separation in the detail how you've got this like really sturdy almost masculine military style boot and then you've got this kind of like squidgy cloud-like puffer ankle around the top i so definitely a much better value pair of boots than a designer pair. I thought with a pair of like really nice buttery soft gym leggings, a really nice jumper like this one or a roll neck jumper and a puffer jacket over the top I thought would just look like a 10 out of 10 
cozy outfit and if you're going on any kind of like Christmassy walks or if on a weekend you like to go and pop and get a hot chocolate with like your partner or your family I just thought this would be such a beautiful like outfit just to throw together and feel really chic and done up rather than just like throwing on your old sweats I think these will be really durable as well and I imagine that they are fully waterproof too so perfect if you're in the mud a little bit and they'll just wipe down at the bottom um, and also the top to be fair because they are more of this like waterproof um, or water resistant should I say puffer material so they should be fine for all your like muddy rainy walking needs too. So yeah, that is everything that I've got for today's haul. I really hope you've enjoyed it and maybe it's given you a little bit of inspiration to go and treat yourself to something for the festive season coming up or the party season or maybe even just to keep nice and cosy and warm. But hopefully you can save yourself some pennies when the Black Friday sale starts. As I said at the beginning of the video, I will leave all the details in the description about my blog so you can go and check out my top picks of the sales also follow me on instagram if you're interested in keeping up with the sales i'll be posting lots of my top picks over on my instagram story and i will also leave the details of truly neutral in the description below so you can go and check out the products we're launching with on monday well, thank you so so much for watching i really hope you've enjoyed this and found it helpful and i will see you in my next video